Okay, I don't have a mic, so hopefully you all can hear me. Today I am without my cameraman and I'm filming on my own. Uh, you all may have known that a few weeks ago we had gotten sick and we actually had the big C word <laughs> and it wasn't fun. But ever since then it really just put us behind. It's put me behind with filming. It's put me behind with house chores. My house is a mess right now. And so I'm still just trying to catch back up, especially with riding. I haven't really ridden in that long since then. And Tucker's starting to get fat. And so I really need to work him and ride him. And I don't want to have to put him in a diet field. So I need to ride him today. That's one goal. Another goal of mine is I've been wanting to clip him and like do his mane and his fetlocks for some time. I've just been waiting because we've been shooting an online course, which actually should be up in a few days. It's an online course on how to lunge your horse, so you can check that out. I'll put the link to my online course shop in the description for you to see. I'm really excited because we finally got done with that course and I can finally just clip him and get him looking good. He's still shedding a bit, but his mane is so uneven. It's grown out from the last time I roached it, but it needs to be done. So I want to do that today as well. Oh, we have something we've been working on that I want to show you guys that I think is super cool and cute. It's still coming along, but we're getting there. So I'll show you that as well. So what I was going to do today is just stick my GoPro on my helmet, but of course I forget my helmet strap for the GoPro. So I don't really know how I'm going to film everything I do today. But I thought I would start with clipping Tucker first. Treats for the mister. So I did give him a bath a few days ago, so I think he'll be fine to go ahead and clip. It's just kind of getting a little crazy. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna shave it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And the reason I do that is I just don't like pulling the manes. It annoys the horse and it annoys me. So this is an easier version of that. All right, feet are done. The interesting thing about Tucker is he has such prominent ergots. And so that makes it a little bit more harder to clip, but I just find it funny that some horses have those and some of them don't. But now I'm gonna do his mane here. I'm actually gonna cut it with scissors first just because it's really thick. I think it'll be easier to trim. Bye bye mane. Here's Tucker's pile of mane on the ground right there. 10 bucks says he spooks on that before the day is over, but his mane has been cut with the scissors. It's just a little baby mane. It's all gone. So now I'm going to take the clippers and just shave the rest off. It's done. Look at him. Let me get that off there. Ta-da! And I am covered in horse hair. Itchy, itchy. But, doesn't he look good? My little polo pony. Baby broom. Are y'all gonna make fun of me that this is the tiny broom I use to clean this stuff up? Now, I'm gonna do something really satisfying here. I have this, well it's a bot fly knife actually, but I've been using it to just help Tucker shut out a bit. So satisfying. Okay. Oh, yes. If that doesn't make you happy, then I don't know what will. Okay, since I'm wearing yellow stripes, I thought I'd do my giraffe saddle pad. Polka dots and stripes. I know it kind of clashes, but I'm just feeling like that today. It's also getting to be that time of year where I need to wash my saddle pad, so I'm probably gonna do that soon because they're gross. I usually just wait till the horses are done shedding out. All right, Pat, let's show them. Here it is. There's the outfit. Stripes, polka dots, roached mane, looking good.
Do you want a treat? Sassy. Spoiled. Come get the soccer ball and I'll give you a treat. Get the soccer ball and I'll give you a treat. Positive reinforcement. Ah, ah. Hey, I think <laughs> you knew exactly what I was trying to do. Yes, yes. Get it. Get it. I'll give you a treat. <laughs> Here. Get it. Show me what you can do. There you go. Kick it. Oh, oh, good boy. That's exactly what I want. I don't think he meant to do that, but this will at least help him realize. Can you kick it again? Come on. No, not around. Of course, as soon as I start talking to the camera, that's when Tucker comes back over to me instead of ignoring me and eating grass. What are you doing, you silly horse? Now he's gonna go get the soccer ball because he knows he's on camera. My course on how to lend your horse should be going live later this week. So I'll just go ahead and put a link in the description to this video just to our online course shop. If y'all wanna see any particular content, especially just like day in the life or things like that, comment down below. I'm looking to do more of these. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel if you find it helpful and entertaining. I'll see y'all next time.